hello everyone in this video i am going to show you five materials you need to try and you need to know how to use them in ips paint x so here if you check the right corner right top corner you can find the materials and you can see there are about you know so many materials like 20 to 30 thousand materials that you can make use of and i just picked five for now this is the part one video and i also upload part two so here in part one video i shared the first five materials that you should know how to use them first one is the tiles so if you are wondering how to use this tiles material so i will share you uh, share with you how to use it so you can find different patterns in these tiles so i'm going for this diamond shape now so click on that shape when you click on that you will get something like that and if you want to position them in some perspective form click on this perspective scale and just adjust those anchor points on that single tail box so you can make it like a 3d version so this is how you can use that tiles actually many of you may not know as a beginner how to make use of it how it since it is look like a flat one so how to make it 3d so this is how we can make it look like a 3d real tiles you can adjust these anchor points also change the shape from diamond to some other way like this so also if you don't want to use that perspective form straight then you can simply click on that material place it just and click on the stick then again go to this perspective form and then use the anchor points to make it 3d like this so in this way you can try for all the tiles material and also you can make use of any pattern that you want to use on the floor flooring purpose like all this thing you can use this method perspective form method and yeah this is how you can you uh, use these styles to uh, you know add some realistic uh, perspective to your artwork and this is the first material and also here you can see there are some wall texture wall tiles that you can also try so for wall it's going to be straight and if you want to make it on in the wall in some other angle then you can use that perspective form as usual so the first one tiles and the second one so for the second one i have choose so as a beginner if you're drawing any art nature related art and if you want to add some raindrops for that then you can go to these fire water lights you have to scroll for a little long time to get that and if you don't have patience for that then you can search for raindrops on window so here is the raindrop for window and once you like that you can click on that star so it will move to your favorite section so you don't need to search for a long time you don't need to scroll instead you can go to favorites and choose that so here you can see by clicking on that repeat it will repeat all over the canvas and you can create this realistic raindrop effect and now we have white background if you change to some other dark background you can able to see it better and still you can see the gray color effects if you don't want that and if you want that to match along with the color of the background then change the blending mode to some other mode like i prefer going for add blending mode you can see so if you want that to be white colored one something like this with the you know the when the environment is too bright then you can go for this add blending mode or you can try any other so this is the second one raindrop sun window and for third i have chosen so the lens flower so lens flower you might have uh, uh, seen in any you know editing apps or draw you know uh, photo editing apps and if you want to search for that you can find it in ibs paint X. this is how it looks you can find under the same firelight uh, water section 
and you may wonder how to use that because we have the black color square background so how to use this is whenever there is a material with bright details and dark background then click on this add blending mode that black color background will disappear instantly you can use this for drawing you know sky uh, space illustration with some you know interstellar matter something like that so asteroids something like uh, like that if you want to use this light flash then you can make use of this material and you can adjust make it bigger like this you can try there are so many different uh, lens flare uh, you know uh, materials here so basically you have to go for add burning mode otherwise you will get this black color background which will not work for any art details so I prefer going for the add planning mode for this. So this is the third material. There are some exciting material that I want to share but that's on the part 2 video. So next comes the part 4 I mean the uh, material 4. For material 4 if you are drawing any nature illustration where it includes rain then you can choose this rain. So there are three rain materials. I don't prefer you to go for repeat option for this. So already there are a, a repeater like inside that. And first one is slanting uh, raindrops. And second one is heavy raindrops. And here you can see it looks very mild. So you can choose any um, one from these three raindrops for your artwork. And if you want to make it little more brighter then you can change the blending mode to add again why i'm choosing add is it will make the brighter white color or light color details very bright so yeah then comes the fifth one fifth one it will be hard for you to search because uh, uh you know that section have so many materials in it so instead go and search in the search option like garland lights if you search for that you will get so many lights serial lights option like this from this you can make use of these light materials like if you are drawing any sunset beach uh, illustration where you have the lights then you can use don't switch on the repeat option for this um, just keep it like this and you know how it looks it re looks realistic you can uh, create that you know any celebration artwork something like that with these lights there are a few other options here you can try this or this or even this if you want few more lines of lights so yeah this is the fifth one if you like this video tell me in the comments below if you want the part two for these uh, materials so yeah thank you for watching bye